Hey lovelies, it's your girl Mass and Jerry Lee, and I'm coming at you with a day in my life as a Debop seller. It's going to be a busy day, it's going to go by so quick, I already know it, but let's get to it. It's 10 a.m. and I'm at the Salvation Army. I'm going to do just a quick little run through and yeah, let's go ahead and get in there. Mask it up, get those hoops through. Goodness, this is life right here. Counts on how you look at it. First, I found this super cute. It's like super lime green, but it's not showing up. But look how cute that is. Front and back. A little mini skirt. And then this vintage long sleeve. I love those sleeves. Cute. So, kind of a fail. I didn't find too much at all little car haul I guess I got two items y'all I got this little Ann Taylor little structured tank I thought it was super cute a little dark academia cottage core vibe and then I don't know what it is about this dress but I think you can do so much with it if it doesn't fit me like it's a perfect staple for anybody's closet but I thought that was really cute Put like a big flannel over, tie something at your waist. I'm with some sneakers, just be chilling. So yeah, five dollars. I am out of here. I'm gonna get coffee today. I'm gonna buy a coffee. I'm gonna get Dutch Bros. Woo! You know, what? treat yourself to some Dutch Bros today. If you're hearing this, go to Dutch Bros, Starbucks, whatever your poison is. Treat yourself, girlfriend. You deserve it. All right, lovelies, I am back. Came back home. <sighs> I ate some spring rolls that I had left over from yesterday. And now I'm in my office. I changed into a comfier dress. Let's get packing. Um, I luckily, not luckily, but I only have four packages today because I shipped yesterday. So just a little, just a little shipping today. I have these cute little envelopes that I put like my business card and like just some little stickers and um, whatever else, maybe earrings, whatever I have found or I think is cute and returning customer. I like to add freebies and send you gifts because I appreciate you. So you know what it is. I have um, a homemade stamp that I stamp onto like my boxes and these envelopes. It's a sewing machine with an MJ. I send Jared Lee, so I'm stamping them right now. So yeah. Need to shut down to keep you out of my mind. It's strange to be here alone. Yeah. A place that we used to go all the time. I need to do this alone, so just stop calling me up Just realize that we're done, don't come back And I need to do this alone, so just stop calling me up Just realize that we're done, I won't come back I have dreams about us I just want it to stop Cause I miss you so much I miss the way we touch And I need to make it stop They come in bucket sizes. Like, look at that. That thing is huge. I love bucket size. So good. If you guys are new to Debop, 
My biggest tip is to package with care, y'all. Just package with care. I know, like, I've gotten something that's just, like, straight up. Like, I know this paper is a mailer, but don't just put your sweater in there. Put your sweater in a bag and then put it in here because this thing gets so dirty when it crosses, when it goes across the United States. Even if you're shipping worldwide, like, it gets so dirty. I got a sweater and I was like, okay. Um, like these denim, I have two pairs of vintage Wranglers going out. They're only going to California. So I'm gonna ship them in this like little paper oversized mailer. But put it in a plastic bag because this this could rip and it could get something on the denim. And um, honestly, buyers just really enjoy you going that little extra step too. Send it with care, y'all. All right, I got that all done. I'll probably head to the post around three, so I got a few hours till then. Wait to see if any other orders will come in. But I need to cut up some shorts. All right. If you find Wranglers on the Lolo, Wranglers, Levi's, like any big dad denim, I, I seriously, I just save them, save them, save them. And then when summer hits, I make them into cutoffs and they sell like crazy. So that's what I do, y'all. These are from yard sales. My mom hit a yard sale and this lady had a fat bag of them. So that's where a lot of these came from. But it's, it's just, um, very easy money. Debot pro tip. I literally, um, how I do it is where the, where the crotch ends. I just do it about an inch down and the length is usually like perfect. You have enough length to like cuff it or let it fringe out. It's not that I don't living room as well but sometimes i feel like it like it blends too much i feel like these mickey mouse pants they're not gonna look cute on this rug so i have this white sheer so i'll put it right over so it kind of mutes the color so this will stand out more on it you feel me this is just my shower curtain honestly I have this cute little mini skirt with like the red popping out uh, Victoria Sport sports bra. I like this one. I originally bought it for me, but these pop on me all the time, so I'm not even gonna ruin it. I'll let someone else enjoy it. I have these little biker shorts. I got three bathing suits. I need to get posted because I'm not trying to get stuck with them. 
some cuteness. Little free people overalls. These really cute little low rise pants. I have this red little corset. I think it's so cute with the little rhinestones. A little pleated skirt. Look at these bottoms. These bottoms are so freaking cute. I looked online to see like if I could find the top for them. And it's actually a tankini. And I thought because it has this like really cute metal onto it, like the top will be gorgeous, but it's actually like super granny. But look at that little strawberries. They're so freaking cute with the little gingham print the hardware like i'm obsessed with them so i figured like you can put like a gingham little top or like a black one or even a pink one look any color honestly you can pop out of this like plain top would be super cute and then i've had this little skirt that i need to get posted up finally so yeah All the time. I got my whole little pile done, got it on the table ready to measure, and after that I took my packages to the post office, I went and got some groceries for my work week, and yeah, now I'm back. This is my goal to get this death pile measured by today, and then I'll measure everything, have it keyed, and then for the rest of the night, I'll just be writing the descriptions. This is what I do every single day. Um, I also have to do my bookkeeping. I do everything by hand. I'm old school, so I ship and then I'll go and write it into my bookkeeping. So when tax season comes around, um, your girl's ready. When I measured, I measure everything you guys like. I measure the chest, the waist, the length, and the sleeve. With the pants, I'll measure the rise. Because people don't know if that's like really high-waisted because everyone's opinion on high-waisted is different. If it's not 13 inches, it's not high-waisted to me. So I do the rise, the waist, the hips, and then the inseam length. So. That's what I got going on. Check out these Levi's, you guys. I got them at a yard sale and they're so gorgeous. I actually got four pairs, these navy ones. And then I got a pair of Levi's with the big E and that's like the really rare ones. So I was super stoked on that. on my couch um all the clothing that's in here is already like measured posted and ready like up for sale and then i have a death pile that i thrift on my couch like my shop is going into my living room um this is my spare bedroom and oh my goodness like i hope this doesn't go into my room soon um my house is little, you guys. It's just me and like my shop is like taking over my house. So freaking crazy. Anyways, um, I'll catch you guys on the flip side. Catch me on TikTok. That's where you can find me all week long. I try to post one every single day, if not every other day. And check out my Bebop. If you see anything you like, hit me up. Let a girl know. And yeah, bye. Did I say thank you for watching? If not, thank you so much for watching, you guys. I appreciate you because you are my friends. You are my only friends.